Okay, this is uh, Leak Code 49 Group Anagrams. They're asking to look through the string and then return uh, an array of arrays that contain all the anagrams in separate arrays. So uh, how I approach this, what you can do is you can create uh, basically a little object map of this. And while you're looping through the input array up here, you can sort these different words, check to see if the word already exists inside of this object. And if it does, then you can simply just push onto the array and then from there, just return uh, all of the values from the object. So to code it out, it looks like this. Here's our loop. So we're looping through all of these input strings. And then what we'll do is we'll create a key. And we'll use this key for this object here. And what we're doing here is we're sorting these words as they come through. Let's see if I can't show that to you. Yeah, see, so et get sorted to aet aet ant sorted for tan okay so now that we have the sorted versions of these words what we can do is check to see if they exist in the object Okay, so if it's not in the object, set it to an array, right? So we're setting the value here in this key value pair to be the actual word because that's I, right? We're looping through strings, so eat sort eat into uh, into AET. Then what we do on this line here, does AET exist inside of the object? It does not. So then, oops, this needs to be the object. So then set the value to an array with just EAT in it. And the key is uh, sorry, the value is eat, and the key here is uh, a e t. So then from there we'll do an else, and we will take that object key. And because it's an array, we can push uh, onto it another I. So if we can, let's console log this out. Right now, console log out object. Let's run this, see what we get. Uh, here we go. So you can see it, it worked. 
our key for our AET has uh, these values in it. The key for ANT has these values in it. So all we need to do now is return the values of that object. So let's run this, make sure I typed everything out correctly. It works. We'll hit submit. All right, got to get uh, accepted there. That's great. And if I can zoom out here a little bit, you can see all of the code on one screen. Maybe that's a little small. Whoa. Come on, Chrome. Okay, so that's all the code in one screen. Hope this was helpful. If you like, go ahead and subscribe and like, all that good stuff. Otherwise, see you next time.